Boy, what up, y'all? Good morning. Good morning. It is our last full day here at Catalonia. I know. Pools are back. Make the most of it by floating in pools and doing stuff like that. Having and some more breakfast. Chilaquiles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, what do you get? We don't even know yet. I have no idea. I'll have to look at the menu again. That's a good idea. Okay. All right, well, let's go get some breakfast and get our day started. Sounds good. Well, let's have a hangout day. Mm -hmm. Come on. All right. See ya. The skies are blue, the temperatures are, well, pretty nice. It's windy, but it's supposed to be, I think it's supposed to be 80 again today, maybe sipping it in. Okay. Good morning, Reading Corner. Good morning, Pretty Fountain thing. Good morning, Weird Owl Noises. I <laughs> I'm a chilaquile restaurant. <laughs> Welcome to a world of chilaquiles. Starting off with the appetizer course, we've got strawberry yogurt, fruit plate, which they've run out of granola, but they do have the honey, and natural yogurt. Mm -hmm. Wow. So D is representing Team Chilaquiles this morning with the Verdes con Pollo. I know, I'm probably going to be helping yes, you out you with them. <laughs> Fly back over the fruit plate. And I got um, something that's going to have to be a caption on the screen, but it looked good. It was fried eggs and sauce and peas and ham. Heck yeah. It's so inviting. I just want to jump right in, but you know, we probably should pick a chair and get ready and stuff before we hop in the water. Change cameras, important stuff like that. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, looks like there's We're some cleaning, cleaning devices in that pool. Well, it's we could time. hit back over to the privileged pool. I don't know. Yeah. Right, time for all this pool action. Y'all hear that owl? It stopped now. Gosh, there's more bird noises. Anyway, yeah. we're going to get all up in this. I know. I feel like these owl noises are all over the place. And Dee is convinced, like we said earlier, that it's like canned and being pumped in. I don't know. Like, it's got to be real owls. Why would they just... But owls there don't he is. make noise in the day, isn't it? This one does. I don't know. It's a, it's a, it's a buo borracho. Yeah, okay. I don't know. Let's find out together. Oh, that's not bad. Okay. We're getting in, y'all. You should probably, you know, put your actual just like swimsuit. I mean, these are waterproof. Okay, just jump on in then. <laughs> sure uh, it's actually a good temperature. All right, okay. Caw -caw, our little friend this morning. Thought he was gonna go check out the ballet bed. Oh no, he's drinking water out of like a little crack. Okay. He came and tasted the pool, but he didn't like it. So I'm not sure if this is actually salt water. I feel like it is. Is it, it, is it chilly when you say No, oh, no, it's great. Okay, all right, just checking. Ah, I always make these noises at nine in the morning. Yep. No, I don't. Uh, <laughs> pool spin. Oh, D is still not down back there, is she? I got all the way down. It was very mm. chilly. <sighs> nope, but, I'm comfortable right here. Okay, you just live right there. Okay, bye. <laughs> is she gonna get all the way in this pool or what? I know. My gosh. Just keep my arms out. I'm waiting for the sun. Hey, right, you'll be waiting a while. Okay. Bye. So this is what we are doing today. This is called <laughs> Basking Day, where we float and we bask. We might go lay on that ballet bed. No, they only have the one ballet bed in this area. There's a few more down on the sand. Mm -hmm. I haven't felt compelled to steal the ballet bed away from anybody yet, but I haven't seen anybody use it. I saw somebody in the swinging one yesterday. Oh, yeah. that's Oh, the swinging ones, yeah. They're down there in the exclusive area. That's yeah. right. <laughs> the Maravilloso. Yeah. Wait. Maravilloso. Okay, I, I think I left a syllable or two out of that. <laughs> Maravilloso. Like marvelous? Yeah, I think it's the marvelous. So you have the privilege level, the exclusive level, and the marvelous level. If you're in the marvelous cinematic universe, you get to use the special beach. So Iron Man, Batman. Okay, I know he's DC. And I know it's Marvel. See, I have to explain all my jokes because they're so stupid. Oh, she's come out to get our music pumping for today. You were excited for the music to start I, back. I really like having music around a pool. Like, mm -hmm. I don't know, it just adds the whole ambiance. <laughs> All right, well, we'll see. So she'll kick us up some tunes. Mm -hmm. It's probably some of the same tunes we heard yesterday. I don't care. I did notice we heard some songs twice yesterday. You know, it was good. There's a lot of Carly Rae Jepsen. 
she has. Yeah. Oh yeah. It was it was very heavy on Carly Rae Jepsen yesterday. But that's cool. That's cool. That's funny. <laughs> oh, we have a very light jazzy rendition of uh, Can't Help Falling in Love, which we've noticed is the same song they started us with yesterday. <laughs> so I think the same playlist comes on every day, but that's all right. There was some good stuff in there. I'm shivering. She's cold. Here, let's, the sun. let's reverse the spin so you can see her again, hopefully behind my big head. I'm probably perfectly blocking you with my big head, that's but cool. I can't tell because here, we'll, we'll slide over just to make sure that we can see you. Oh my gosh, are you okay? Are you gonna make it? <laughs> You know, this is what we're doing all day is being cold in a pool. I mean, if the song comes out, it's fine. It's just because I got all the way in here. But if I get out, I'll be colder. So now uh, I'm stuck. Yeah. <laughs> Such a hard We're going to have to sneak you over to that towel hut so you can get a I towel. I didn't get a towel. I know. <laughs> well, yeah, we're smart. You might have to sneak over there. Oh my gosh, don't make me freeze. <laughs> <laughs> you make me suffer. I see how it is. You, we saw Alba. Do you remember we saw Alba in like yeah. live? We really did here in Mexico. That was amazing. Anyway, stop it. <laughs> oh, Dee has espied a cute yellow bird over here on the fence past the shower, which um, I can't zoom in on because this camera doesn't do that. So let's walk down here and see this yellow bird. Are you a little owl that makes owl noises? Probably not. Oh my gosh. Did it? Whoa. Okay. Um, there were a lot of bird noises happening. There's three or four of them in that tree. Uh, yeah, I guess they live up here in the trees somewhere. We can just sit here and bask at this for a while. Whew. Nice. A little flyover. Oh, oh yes. What's that? Oh, the sky looks a lot nicer over there. <laughs> Pretty cloudy today, but you know what? I don't mind. This is perfect for my delicate complexion. A little warmer, I'd be all right with <laughs> <laughs> Well, I guess that could be true. But yeah, no, like UV wise, like, well, I mean, you're still getting UV rays, but yeah. not too bad. I like how we're both just kind of leaned up on this little surface. It's almost like we're just staring at the bar, just <laughs> willing it to open. We're not. This just happened to be a... I'm uh, doing leg kicks, yeah, but yeah, it does look like we're just... A staring. convenient surface for us to just kind of lean on and relax. I don't care. We're just like <laughs> staring down the bartender like, come on, man. <laughs> I could care less. <laughs> That's funny though. Maybe we'll go pick a different spot. <laughs> I mean, I'm fine staying here. I don't feel weird being a, a creeper. <laughs> Y'all, we have found this drink again. We had this for the first time at Occidental. Didn't know what it was called. It is a snake bite. Yes, I think it's Irish cream. Uh, yeah, I guess it's like Bailey's on the bottom, Kahlua in the middle, and then what, a blue Hawaii on top. So we found it again. Yes, it's the one that looked like D. Anyway. <laughs> Y'all, they come up with the most fun little shots around here. He read off a list of what he had. I think he said this one is called Mexican Eggs because it looks like a yolk and a white floating in a clear liquid. I have no idea what it is. There was one that was called, well, I'll clean it up a little bit for the YouTube, but it was called like Poop in the Grass, and we'll have to try that one too. It was like brown on top and green on the bottom. We didn't get to try that one yet, but let's see. Is this one, did you, oh, she didn't even try it yet, y'all. Just come on, see how eggs, you like eggs? What is it? I don't know. It's a Mexican egg. Give it a try. Is it it's not eggs? Really. No, it's, there's no real eggs in there. It's like whipped cream and... Oh. I don't know what that is. Interesting. Yeah, we had one yesterday that involved whipped cream. I don't know. We'll just go for it. That's very mild. Okay. I like that. Y'all yeah, eggs are delicious and they're healthy. It's good protein for you, right? We're done with water mode. We're in dance and lunch mode. Heck yeah, I guess it's time. It's 12. All right, whoosh. Y'all, yeah. we did a thing. We asked, I know, nowhere on this property at any point have we been able to find chips and salsa and guac, just like as a snack or any sort of menu or anything like that. So we asked them if there was any way that they could do chips, guac, and salsa for us today at lunch, and they said yes as an appetizer. That's now, the th thing I realized is I don't think they actually have chips on their menu for lunch at all. Like breakfast, they have chilaquiles on tap, so they have chips going, so I think they had to special fry us a batch of chips, which I feel bad about. No, I know. But they did it. That I did. Super, super, super. Yeah. I mean, we're, there's two of us in here. That's true. I, I didn't realize that there are no chips on the menu technically for lunch, but they did make us a cool snack. So, obviously, sometimes if you ask, this is true. What's not on the menu, you will find. Because I've seen people like toast isn't on the menu, and I've seen people at breakfast have toast and stuff. So sometimes it's okay to ask for things. 
If they don't have it, they don't have it. True. It doesn't hurt, right? Yeah, yeah. Dean has got a beef sandwich going on with a cute little basket of fries. That looks really good. It really does. Mm -hmm. And I got a um, caption on the screen, but it was a beef dish. Heck yeah, this looks good. Y'all, we finally broke down and got a lunch dessert. We had not tried one that. yet, I know. <laughs> but they had a cake that had like cherries involved. Now granted, these are strawberries and blackberries, but it says there's cherries involved and it sounded perk to good. Okay, well, we gonna eat it. We are done with lunch. That was probably my favorite lunch so far, but getting ready to go back in water mode now. Jam to the music and just have fun. Cause that's what life is all about, right? Jamming the music and having fun. It is pool mode time again. Man. It's colder, than, well at least the sun is out. So hopefully we're doing well. He is perched up. This is how you get in the pool. This is as far as you want to get in the pool, apparently. Sunny now, it's chilly. Yeah, it's not as I'll bad as this morning. Later. Yeah, I'll true. Like All right, we'll let you get settled. Okay. So this is where we will be for the next forever. That's how that works. Forever? Exactly. It's one o'clock. There's a lot of music, so probably not a lot of recording. Unless, you know, super awesome fun things happen, but this is just what we're doing. We're chilling with songs, sunshine, good times. I think there may be a few activities later. The morning activities, they didn't happen, but that's fine because it's mostly pool stuff and I think it was too cold. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, bye for now. Girl, are you listening to like? I didn't turn the playlist on. Is all rock I have to say. songs out here? They playing pony. It's the weekend, and there's more local families. So it's just really interesting. They like, just played a song I think was called Freaky Friday with all the expletives and everything in it. I mean, it's exciting. And then we kind of thought, you know, maybe it's English, so. Yeah, you know. I mean, I don't know that I would know if I heard like a swear word in Spanish. It's true. So, oh, we well. know what it does. It's just funny. <laughs> Oh, no, he's yeah. phased by it. Oh, hey, son. Don't sing it. Oh, no. Shh, no, shh, we shh. sang it in choir. Well, no. Okay, the teacher was out of the room, but like our whole choir broke into this song. <laughs> you are not a good example. It was hilarious. Stop being a bad it example. Was funny. All right, that's it. It's definitely not a good example. Don't do, don't do it, kid. Hey, boy. Nope. Do they come right to me. They I really call? do. You are the Sereke Whisperer. I'm the Sereke Whisperer. <laughs> Yikes. I don't have anything for it. But. Well, I've got this lovely little Mexican flag shot here that Pedro has brought us. Pedro's been taking good care of us today. He has. I know. Me. Look at that thing. That's awesome. Here, let's hold. Oh, so beautiful. <laughs> anyway, between Gerardo, Francisco, and Pedro, holy moly, we've been taken care of. If you come here, you're going to have great service. Oh, uh, yeah. Regardless of when you come, I feel. Like, I've seen other videos, and they all. It's a smaller resort, so that's why you have more than personalized experience. True. Fantastic. Yeah, 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 but this is where we'll be for the next few hours. So yeah. us and Bruno Mars. That's what I yeah. get. <laughs> okay. Bingo into beach volleyball again. So that's the same schedule that they did yesterday. Let's go. Yeah, the schedule said there was a kids game at three, but I guess it's gonna be bingo. Yeah, plus the fact that there are no kids. Right. So cool activities going on for the afternoon. Are you looking? She's looking at me in the camera screen. I'm making sure Do you approve? you're viewing. Yeah, you're good. You look nice. You gotta get all my angles right. Yeah. yeah. Rock show? I want to go to the rock show. We are going to the rock show at 9.30. Okay. In the theatrical. Is that how you say it? Yeah, sounds good. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we are done with water mode. We're sneaking back to the room. And we're gonna get ready for dinner. So it's a little early. We got some time to kill, but showers and all that mess. We'll see y'all when we're all fresh and clean. Our towel animal of the day is well, I call it the crab rangoon. I'm not exactly sure what it is, but it looks like something. Kinda. Again, they did our uh, little bed runner diagonally. I think that means goodbye. Peace out. <laughs> Good evening. evening. We are ready for dinner. So I told you we'd see you when we're ready for dinner. <laughs> Guess what? Surprise, we're ready. Dinner time. Well, yes. I feel like we did so many exciting things today. All the stuff. We chilled. It was nice. <laughs> hanging out in pools. Yeah. But we are going to the Italian restaurant mm -hmm. tonight, which is Toscana. Toscana. 
See. The only things open, hey, that works for Italian too, <laughs> and Spanish, were uh, Toscana and then the tapas restaurant mm -hmm. again, which we had already eaten at. Yeah. So we're going back to the Italian restaurant that we ate inside to Four actually tapas. eat Italian food this time. Yes. Is that confusing? It's the same restaurant, but different yeah. menu because it's actually for the Italian restaurant. That. Yeah. So words and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> All right. See you there. Okay. okay. Bye. <laughs> Bye. All right. I'm I'm Team Ramp. Where are you going, Ramp? Yeah. All right. That's a pretty steep ramp. <laughs> so right back in here, past the T-bar. This seems awfully familiar. Okay, we had the menu on the phone, but they did give us the actual hard copies of the menus. And he said, I guess this one is a little bit more of a structured experience where you get one appetizer, which is this section up here, and one main course, which would include either a freshly made pasta selection, which I think Dee is gonna do, um, or something over here from this entree section. And then they do have an exclusive section, which we don't qualify for, because we're privileged, but we're not exclusive or maravillous. Correct. <laughs> They've started us out with a little tomato bruschetta, just an extra bonus, so cool. They came by with the bread. I decided on a focaccia with some cheese on it. We got oil and vinegar, and he asked if I wanted Parmesan cheese, and I was like, heck yeah. Boom, he loaded that bad boy up. That's what it's like. Well, this is what it looked like before. Yeah, cause, eyeballs. Well, it's just, yeah, magic. Um, it, the, <laughs> But <laughs> she decided not to load it up with cheese. Yep. Uh, you got the pesto bread. So it's like me. Funny, because you actually ordered pesto for your food, and then I you got the pesto, pesto. bread. Oh, bruschetta? Yeah, bruschetta. bruschetta. Yeah. It was. Mm -hmm. Anyway. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna have some cheese bread and some cheese and some cheese cheese, but <laughs> Once again, we have a lovely ocean view out the window Kind of a little uh, purpley sunset action going on D is beginning with melanzane, which is their eggplant parmesan. I've had that a lot at like Cucina del Capitano and stuff Usually real good it's an appetizer. Heck yeah, that's a big appetizer. <laughs> I got a bowl of minestrone soup. Kind of dark. Here we go. Let's get that close-up minestrone soup action. Well, the bowl is stinking huge, but I mean, the portion, that's pretty good for an appetizer. Yeah, um, you'll probably need chairs. Yeah, true. But you can try it. <laughs> Looks good. Yeah. Ooh, I'm real dark, but anyway, y'all get to look at it, the cool view behind me. Soup is good. I guess they've gone for sort of a more noodle approach and no beans. I'm used to minestrone having beans, but maybe that's, I don't know, but still good. How's your eggplant rocking over there? Nice. <laughs> the pesto parade continues. Dee has tagliatelle and pesto, and I went with lasagna al forno. Hey, focus. There we go. <laughs> Dessert mode D has gone with the fruit plate. There's a little lime, I guess maybe a sorbet, sorbet or something hiding in there somewhere. And I decided to try, oh gosh, the cassata. This looks a little bit more like uh, what I was thinking of last time I tried a cassata. It was something different, but it's like ice cream inside of a cooked, baked thing. I don't know, it looks good. Ah, we are done with Italian food. Pretty good overall. The lasagna was real good. I like that cassata. These pasta, it was a little bland. It wasn't what I was thinking of for a pesto sauce. I mean, it was good, very mild. Anyway, I'm wondering. But lovely overall, just like this lovely lake in the dark. I think rather than killing time in the reading corner or up at the bar, we're just gonna wander back to the room for a bit and come back out later because there is a show to be seen. 8412. Hey y'all, it is evening time. You know we made a mistake by coming back to the room because when you come back to the room to chill out and get comfortable, you just want to stay in the room, continuing to chill out, continuing to be comfortable. So, pretty sure we said earlier that they are having a rock show in the theater at 9.30 tonight, but we have decided to just take some chill time, some downtime. Um, we've ordered room service breakfast for the morning. They, um, I'm sure, you know, being short staffed and all, it was a bit of a struggle getting through to the room service people, but I was able to call the front desk and put in my room service order. So breakfast is coming to us tomorrow. We're excited about that. Look, there's, see little D over there? Hey. I got too much sun. Oh, you might have, yeah. but this just feels nice laying in this bed. <laughs> we might actually go to bed early. Yeah. I mean, it's like 
a quarter to nine or something, and we kind of sleepy. Watching naked and afraid. Yeah, we're watching in Spanish. <laughs> um, well, there's in English, but anyway, um, we relaxed so hard today that we just need a break, a break from it. I mean, thing. you know what I mean? And plus, side note, when we went up to see the Aladdin show, no one was really in there policing the mask policy. Mm -hmm. So granted, there were only 12 people in there and people were spacing out and no one was really close to anybody else, but about half the people were just not wearing masks at all. So it's Saturday night tonight and I, I feel like it's going to be a little busier up there, which means more people not wearing masks. So. You know, we have been half vaccinated. We got shot number one before we came on this trip about a week, week and a half before we came down here. Um, so, you know, we're, we're trying to do our best, but we also don't want to put ourselves around people who, right now at least, who aren't trying to do their best no, too. We try and travel as safely as possible and we show do. you that travel is still possible with following protocols. Yeah. We try to make smart decisions. Yeah. I think tonight's smart decision is Stay. we're going to bed. <laughs> So, editing me, take some footage from the Aladdin show and put it to rock music. You can do it. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Oh, God, I'm sure that was some good stuff. I have no idea. Me, Jay, has no idea what editing Jay just did, but hopefully it was it was entertaining. But that's it for tonight. So we're gonna say good night. Tomorrow is we leave this resort tomorrow, yeah. but we don't go home tomorrow. Nope. <laughs> the adventure continues. So join us tomorrow. Room service breakfast. Mm -hmm. Got a couple of other plans for the morning, and you know we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for joining. Good night. We'll see you in just a minute. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. Happy last morning yeah. from Catalonia Riviera Maya. We're sad we to leave. This was actually a really refreshing budget type option to find because I mean for $135 a night, that's not per person. Mm -hmm. That's total for the month of January. Yeah. Definitely had a good time. Enjoyed it. It's smaller, so you have a more intimate experience, True. I think, honestly. And we did upgrade um, to Preview? It was the privilege, privilege, privilege level. which was not much. It was much to upgrade, and I think it was worth it, honestly. Yeah, I'll yeah. put all the figures and the numbers in the wrap-up video that comes up after this. We'll break down the math. We'll do all that fancy stuff. Yeah. Um, I guess let's throw. We did a uh, room service breakfast, we did. and so let's. I'm gonna throw it editing me to insert some footage here where we do breakfast and some other stuff, and we'll see y'all in a minute. So, okay. editing me, hit it. Our room service breakfast this morning. I got the Mexican breakfast, which I thought was gonna be, yeah, kind of like chilaquiles. It's got some chips and there's fried eggs and stuff on there. We also ordered what they call the wellness breakfast. Well, actually this is the uh, tropical fruit plate, which is a completely separate item. The wellness breakfast is actually this yogurt with fruit. And then there is also cereal. Oh, it's like all brand. Hey now. Um, they've given milk for the cereal. We got two glasses of juice pot of coffee with some coffee cups and the fixins and he said this is like some toast and bread and random stuff so there we go convenient and probably delicious hey guess what it's time for in the shower with jay catalonia edition so let's have a little gander at our subject matter here it's kind of backlit let's get in there Pretty nice and spacious overall. You've got like a rainfall head and a normal shower head, little shelf to put stuff on. They gave conditioning shampoo and shower gel, not these. These we brought, these were provided. But yeah, check out all this space. Wow. Definitely enough room to get in here and party. It's almost like a miniature club. Okay, so let's close the door. Now what I thought was interesting is they have a, what I call a barrel lock. Oh, it's echoey in here. Well, you kind of have to like slide that thing shut. It's a little tight to do, but interesting. But hey, it's secure. <laughs> Tons of room. Definitely gets the job done. I'm not the biggest fan of the overhead rainfall things, but they're cool. This little guy tended to leak a lot, but overall, nice and big sufficient is that a word i don't know i'm gonna give it a 7.05 yeah sounds good 
random other observations about the room, this did turn out to be a sleeper sofa. So, you know, two people could bump, bump out and sleep on a sofa. Ignore our breakfast mess. There was some more storage down here that we didn't even look at when we first did our room tour, but lots of storage. The only weird quirk about this is that it was very hard to find a three-prong outlet in this room for like charging my laptop. What I had to do is the only ones I could find were these lamps in the living area, so I would have to unplug a lamp to charge my computer and put them back in. All the other ones around the bathroom and the bedroom were just two-prong, and that does not make my computer happy. But that's it. All right, we're back. But yeah, I can't think of any other words. We're getting ready to wander down and catch a taxi over to another destination. We'll talk about that here in, a, in another video. Yeah. Um, we're going to take our luggage down ourselves. They they carried the luggage up for us when we got here. And I'm sure if we called them, they would haul it down. But we are I'm, capable. I'm not going to put them out like that. There's no <laughs> elevator in the building, but it's one flight of stairs. It's not bad at all. Yeah. Any other words before we say bye to Catalonia? Um, I've enjoyed my time. Me it's too. Pretty, pretty good. Every pretty good. Day, for the most part, staff, phenomenal. As yes. always, every time we go to Mexico, the staff is always great. See. I enjoyed the ledges in the pool. I know that's something strange, but like, it works. that's something different. They have lower ledges that you can just mm. chill and relax. So that was kind of fun. Um, yeah. It's not too big, so it's super easy to get around and find Brilliant. your way. And I feel like, you know, we got to do everything we wanted to and see everything. I so, did. Yeah. Even went to the spa. We did. That was really cool. <laughs> but I guess that is it for this video. So hopefully you enjoyed hanging out with us here at Catalonia Riviera Maya. Yeah. Um, if you have not already, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Become a Paromaniac today. Socialize all our media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Yep. And until next time. Rock, rock on. on. More adventures coming soon. Stick with us. <laughs> Gosh, our checkout adventure was interrupted by a nature sighting. Dee's like, an iguana! I haven't seen any of those this trip. I think I saw one, but he wasn't that big. Hey, friend. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. He might come after me. He might be mad. Okay, I can go. You didn't contact his agency before asking him to be your model. Can you take your photo? Nope, too late. I'll delete it, it's fine. <laughs> Man, our taxi driver has a turtle! Awesome! Oh yeah, our suitcases are having a hard time. <laughs>